So Beyond Trust is probably best well known for Password Safe, which is our privileged access management tool. Um, we also, uh, through the acquisition that uh, occurred with Beyond Trust from the private equity partner, Francisco Partners, brought together several, several other technologies. So we're focused on Endpoint Loose Privilege, which is the old DefendPoint product, and Privilege Remote Access, where we see big opportunities for third-party vendor access, access into OT environments, um, and we focus on three of those major product domains and seek partners which can obviously align with us there again, and that's what we will continue to do. We, we are recruiting, but not a mass recruitment by any stretch. We've got a fairly developed channel across the region. Uh, we may add or we'll take away partners if they're not working. Um, it just depends on the, the, the synergy between ourselves and partners. Again, it's, it's broadening out as Beyond Trust as a vendor has um, grown in size in the region. Our need for more partners like Help AG is, is more relevant. So if we're looking across the region, we want to strengthen in all of the key uh, territories that we sell into where we have salesperson alignment to ensure that we've got the right partners working with us. They're aligned with us, we're aligned with them. Um, and there's a, there's a key business plan together with each other to execute on. It's the only way where we find success. There are a lot of partners that knock on our door wanting to work with us but really it's those that double down and, and focus on the same things we do where we find success and that strategy really just continues. We're not looking at volume, it's just the, the quality of partner we would work with. Services for us, whether that be pre-sales, so they develop the, the ability to support either their salespeople or our salespeople. We have a pre-sales team, we have a sales team, but really if we're trying to expand in the marketplace, partners, partners can take advantage of us and the opportunity that's there by investing in their own pre-sales practice and then service delivery for us in terms of the ability to execute against projects. Beyond Trust will take a role if um, an end user requires it for us to either take part of the design or integration that's particularly complex or it might be a review of configuration but we're not a GSI service delivery type of organisation. We will always look for local partners to be able to supplement us. And we often find with local partners, they have existing relationships and they have a big desire to be able to fulfil that um, delivery model themselves. It just helps strengthen their arm within their end user customers. Um, for us, it's all about penetrating accounts and it's a partner that has a strong sales team that we can align with my sales team on opening up new business accounts or expanding in accounts that they own or we own and having the expertise in there just to be able to introduce us to the right um, buyers in the account or whether it's helping us go through a commercial process together uh, is one side of it. And then for us, we have service delivery capability but we really wish and want to partner with service delivery partners that have a full-blown project delivery team and that's something Help AG do better than many other partners within the region um, and that really is a key thing for us. The after sales uh, service and ongoing support is something that's big value to Beyond Trust. Now, one of the things that we've seen in 2019 has been a big investment in channel partner whether it be marketing. Beyond Trust and Help AG have already done several events uh, their Spotlight event earlier this year where we connected with their customer base um, and we'll continue to do more of that. We're very focused on things like roundtables, so if a partner has a strong set of enterprise customers that we're not engaged with, then we would be delighted to be able to sit down with those partners and um, talk about privileged access management, endpoint lease privilege or privilege remote access. Well, that partnership with Help AG goes back to really the beginning of when we opened an office in Dubai. Uh, we strategically, and I say strategically, look for a small number of very close partners. And close to us means a number of things, not just somebody that will transact with us and help us with their relationships uh, in the accounts we want to sell to, but can add the value which they've been doing for many other vendors for a long time. And that's really helping us deliver projects sometimes aftercare support, whether that's in their MSP operation. And for us, there was no stronger partner focused on security than Help AG um, back when we started the business in Dubai and the, the Middle East, and it still remains the same today.